Ryan Sproul has things that we can't teach in the offensive zone. He, we can't teach 6-3, we can't teach a rocket from the shot, we can't teach the, the ability to know how to jump in offensively. Uh, he's not afraid to jump into the play, he's very confident with the puck, he sees the ice well, uh, he can create offense and uh, he's very confident in his abilities. Ryan is unique and he knows it and he played midget longer than anybody else we've drafted. Uh, I think for me it's actually, it's been a long ride for me personally with uh, injuries in the OHL, but even before that where uh, I was cut from junior A and I had to go play midget and it was kind of in that stage where do I want to do this for my life or do I want to go to school and, and continue with that. He didn't know exactly if he should go to Michigan and go to school or if he should go play in the Ontario Hockey League where he was drafted. He decides. He goes to the OHL and he plays. He scores 14 goals the year we draft him. He did something right. He scored a lot of goals. The hardest thing for a defenseman in hockey is to score goals. He did something right. Now the following year, he gets better, but he breaks his jaw. He took a puck in the jaw, saw the x-ray, it was a part. He gets some pins in, Six weeks later, he's playing with the full cage on. Not every young player can do that. There's lots of skilled players in the National Hockey League. It's learning to compete for every square inch. It's learning to, you can't turn the puck over. You got to box out, you know, as the puck goes back to the point, your defense, your defenseman. That's not what he did in junior. In junior, he carried the puck. He joined the rush. He created a fence. Got a stroll. He's got a big shot himself. We haven't seen much of it in this building. He's going to tee it up here. Drive. Oh. Score! <laughs> I think from a consistency standpoint, like a lot of young players, he needs to now learn to do that day in and day out. But uh, you know, Jimmy Pack working with the defense down in Grand Rapids and Jeff Blaschel and Spiro Sinastis you know, did a really good job in, in putting Ryan in positions to succeed and I think he was real comfortable there. He's got a thing that he just keeps overcoming adversity. Now, how good he's going to be at the NHL level, I can tell you already now, he can shoot the puck better, harder, under pressure than 90% of the NHL players. He knows there's something to work on. He tackles it. He meets the challenge. And now this summer, we had the exit meetings. He is already working out. He knows what he wants. And he knows what he doesn't want. He wants to be a Detroit Red Wing. He doesn't want to be in the American League for way too long. His performance will decide.